Hello everyone, welcome. Today, we're tackling a big upgrade. We'll be moving from the very old Mac OS X 10.6.8, also known as Snow Leopard, all the way to the latest Mac OS version. It's a massive jump, so let's get started. First, understand this isn't a direct, one-step process. You can't simply click update and be done. Snow Leopard is too old. This involves a series of upgrades. Think of it like climbing stairs. We'll need to go up a few steps at a time. Before anything, back up your data. This is extremely important. Use Time Machine or clone your hard drive. Losing your files would be terrible. Make sure you have enough free space. Aim for at least 20 gigabytes, but more is better. Next, let's upgrade to OS X Lion 10.7 or Mountain Lion 10.8. You might need to purchase these from Apple or find a compatible installer. These older operating systems are not available on the Mac App Store anymore. Search online for where to purchase them. Download the installer file and follow the on-screen instructions. After upgrading to Lion or Mountain Lion, check app compatibility. Some older programs might not work. Now we can upgrade to OS X Mavericks, 10.9, Yosemite, 10.10, or El Capitan 10.11. These might be available for free from Apple's support website. Again, download the installer and follow the prompts. With El Capitan installed, upgrading becomes easier. You can now upgrade to macOS Sierra 10.12 or High Sierra 10.13 through the Mac App Store. Look for them using the search function within the App Store. From High Sierra, you can usually upgrade directly to a more recent version. Check the Mac App Store for the latest compatible Mac OS. Each Mac OS upgrade takes time. Be patient. Don't interrupt the installation process. Once you've reached the latest compatible Mac OS, explore the new features. It will be a completely different experience. If you are using old hardware, it may not support the newest operating systems. Consider the age of your Mac. Some older Macs can't run newer software. Check Apple's compatibility list to make sure your machine is supported. This will save you time and frustration. Upgrading an older Mac is complex. If you are not computer savvy, consider taking it to a professional. They can handle the upgrade for you. Thanks for watching. I hope this guide helped you understand the process of upgrading from Snow Leopard to the latest macOS. If you found this video helpful, please consider liking it. Every little bit of support helps to keep the channel going. Also, please subscribe for more helpful tutorials and tips. Your support is greatly appreciated. See you in the next video.